Oh no, not Ubisoft. Not long, let's let's be entirely honest. Well, the internet didn't survive, so... Okay, Zombie you. Yeah, I know, this is kind of weird. First video of the year. And it's this. I felt like doing something, alright? Don't judge. So, the other day... Yeah, about a week and a half ago... I was re-watching 28 Days Later. And I went... Huh. And I immediately... <laughs> I immediately re-watched... 28 weeks later, and still somehow I went, huh. And then I was like, oh, let's, I should play Zombie U again. Ah, fuck it, we'll record it. There we go, getting that, getting that swear in nice and early. Fuck you, monetization. Anything tries to claim this, well, you're not getting anything, damn it. Yeah, so this game's uh, kind of old. A bit over eight years, actually. So let's just start now. Alright, so as you can see, we got a ton of stuff, including you play. Ha ha ha, no. Options, let's just have a look for one sec. This should just be, yep, for default. Good. Yep, rumble, yeah, aiming help. Yeah, auto aim. No, I don't, I don't care. Display. Aha, uh -huh, brightness. Well, I'm using an Elgato, so I don't care if I'm cheating. Subs on. Um, I'm just leaving it on this, fuck it. Radio. um, enough of that. So, yeah, this, uh, this game's weird. In a good way. Didn't do well, unfortunately. Because it's a pretty neat game. I'm not gonna... Is it, this isn't, like, one of my favourite games ever. This is just... A pretty cool game that came out at the very start of the Wii U's life cycle. And got ported to other consoles, but didn't do well. Alright, campaign. Yeah, as you can see, last time I played it. Hmm. Didn't get very far. Yes. I'm pretty sure there was at least one or two files before that. I'm positive. Anyway, here we go. Stand up. It has been a long bloody time since I played it, because that, that was the last time. And in those days, shall men seek death, and shall not find it, and shall desire to die, and death shall flee from them. The alchemy of wealth from air. Will bring a second blight upon me. Makes it feel like it's Dark Souls. This fog of death will cloak the land, and those men who are not prepared will succumb to its foul clutches. For God shows no mercy on those who heed not his words. Thus will the end come, and the world, made unworthy in his eyes, will be purified by black angels, so that he may begin anew. Yeah, so it's, uh, it's not like this is exactly like 28 Days Later. Again, if you couldn't tell, I, I quite like that film. I, I only watched it for the first time, like, what? All, uh, early December 2019? I was only in grade 3 when it came out, so, you know, I, I, I can be forgiven for not watching a movie that horrific and violent. When I was, you know, that young. Now, oh, well, someone will be judging me, I'm sure. Now, if anyone here, out of the... Possibly four people that'll look at this video. Think this is tasteless due to COVID in Britain. Nah. I didn't feel tasteless when I did Remake 3. Um, so, fuck it. <laughs> let's, let's be honest, Boris is doing a shit job. Yes, you. Yeah, follow the voice. Run! Now, I completely forget the controls, so let's see how this goes. Don't just stand there gawping. Hurry! 
Hurry up. So it feels my duty as, you know, as an Australian to take some kind of cathartic pleasure from the suffering of the British. In the context of this game, not in the context of COVID. That's kind of fucked. Up the ladder we go. Now, I think from memory you can totally fuck this section up and not make it. Now, I don't remember if they can climb ladders. I don't believe they can. But I could be wrong. I will be pleasantly surprised if they can. Whoa. Flashlight, there we go. So yeah, main gimmick. You guys aren't seeing it, but the inventory is on the gamepad. Which is the neatest feature of this game. Okay. Yep, alright. Now the beautiful thing about Zombie U, and the reason I am actually kind of scared of it. Oh, well not that. I remembered that. Um, unlike a lot of horror games, or just games in general, I don't know how the fuck this game works. Remake 3, I know basically all the rules. Remake 2, I know all the rules. I know how the dodge works, I know Nemesis' timing, I know his triggers. I know how often zombies will get up. This game, I, I can't even find a fucking map that anyone has gone to the effort of drawing over eight years. But then again, I only checked with like, what, a Cozia or something. I didn't search for it very hard. But yeah, we're uh, in a safe house. Yeah, you're crazy, alright mate, but you were actually going to write the prepper pad. Now you can't see it, but I've gained a mini-map, and there is the ability to ping on my mini-map to check if there's zombies around. Mm-hmm. Rightio, so, whoop, oh, I'm looking at the gamepad. That's kind of a problem here. So we climb through here. X being it is going to fuck me up. Yeah, so it's pretty dark. Okay, yeah, there is a tunnel here. Yeah, so like I was saying, I'm sorry, I'm kind of ignoring the prepper. I don't know how zombies work. I know how the permadeath mechanic works. But I don't know what they're attracted to. I don't know if they can actually ever get inside here. Or if it's just an event to defend the outside. I, I don't know a lot about this game. And that unironic, that honestly scares the shit out of me. It's that whole fear of the unknown. You know, the thing that makes the first Alien film so, so effective. Before we knew the Xenomorph's life cycle. I think that's a pretty apt comparison. Yeah, so there we go. So, yeah, um, you can see the green arrow on my minimap as a green circle. I wish there was a way to capture the gamepad, but, well, I ain't recording it. The last person I tried to help went outside without the pad. And look how that ended. But there is mm. something else you can use. That backpack is a bob. Bug out bag, see? You need it, and what's inside? Ice, okay. I remember this part fairly well. Okay, so this is the door out. We're gonna close that, yeah. Um, I know zombies can bash down doors. That is very true with this and the, re and the Resident Evil remakes. Alright, so... I believe there is a mechanic with crouching that makes you more silent. Now that's run. What's crouch? That's the push, that's the shove. Need a hammer? Yeah, this being X is gonna fuck me up. Okay. We're gonna open some doors to make a getaway just in case. Now might be a good time to try out your Okay, radar. now it's the scripted time. Yep. Okay. So I forget how to duck. But, how, to, how the fuck do you crouch? Quick turn is on that trigger. Okay, so this is a neat little thing. This is the scanning mechanism. So, I can see using the gyroscope on the gamepad. You can see what I'm doing there. Okay, um, how the fuck do you crouch? So, that's also a melee. But yeah, there is a zombie through this wall. Um, slide under. Okay, that's how you do it. So, there's no crouch mechanic. 
so we have to open uh, this. Nope. Okay, cool. Oh wait, no, no, no. Okay, this is the guy we've got to get. Go on, pick up the cricket bat. Don't be squeamish. Think of it as an unspoken. You want a jolly old strike, mate? Because if you got any Won't come over and play the Ashes this year, huh? Cowards. Yeah. Good going. That's okay. India beat us pretty good. Now check that bolt. As I recall, there's a pistol and ammo you're definitely gonna need. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so there we go. I was thinking of the other one. So we need a hammer to get rid of that. I don't think we can bash it open. So right now I'm getting a prompt to look at my... at the gamepad. So as you can see, this is the main draw of the game. I have to look at the screen to manage my inventory. I have to drag the gun. This is kind of like what? The interface for not DayZ, but stuff kind of like that. Okay. So the whole... Um, how do we change weapons? Okay, we have to tap on the gamepad. Yeah, got it. I don't know how sound works as a mechanic in this game. Also, the light. Unlike a lot of survival horrors, or just horror games in general, you can't see it, there is a meter. It builds up from... Um, it goes down from 100. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's good advice, actually. That's really solid advice. Um, it builds up to 99, or it can recharge up to 99. And from that point on, it'll drain over time. So, you know what? That's already good. Because I really don't like the whole... i got to find a billion batteries for your flashlight every five minutes. Of most horror games nowadays. Yeah, so I guess the zombies can get in here because I was thinking there'd be a loading screen. There's not though. CCTV cameras all over London. This one's from a supermarket near you. But the more eyes you have, the better. There's more cameras at that location, so I'll I'll walk you through hacking them. Yeah. People think CCTV cameras are secure, hardwired to police HQ, but they're wrong. I was a Royal Signals boy in the army. I can teach you a thing or two about secure comms. Yep. Anyway. Time for your first field trip. Those cameras won't fix themselves, and you need to do a little shopping. So yeah, we're getting that, we're gonna be doing that scene in most zombie films. We gotta get some food, mates. Pop up a jolly pop down to the shops. Yeah, that was pretty shit to be honest. I'm not going to pretend my English accents are any good. Fuck you. Okay, now let's have a look. So, in case it wasn't evident from what appeared on the screen, saving um, is done by sleeping. So this is a dead end. Not that it would really help us. I'm not getting any zombies on my map, which is a great sign. So this will be a hop over, right? But we can also vault it. Yes, we can. Into the darkness. Into the darkness. So, yeah. Doors like this, I'm not even bothering with, because on my map you can see they're nothing. You guys, on the other hand, do not have any such privilege. Okay, he's opening that for us. Let's just have a look. Yeah, okay, that's the pause. So, looking at the gamepad right now, again, we've got this little peak mechanic is telling me my objective, I can check the ID of my character, the skills I have, an actual map of the area. It's cool. I wish I could show you guys it, but no chance. I'd need a way to record um, the gamepad. So, uh, nah. Let's have a scan. There is nothing so far. Let's just have a cheeky little peek over here. Nothing. My uh, Left 4 Dead senses are kicking in. I feel very much compelled to examine around here. Now, I remember there is a mounted gun there. This section I remember quite well. So I don't remember what under... Oh, I don't remember if there's any circumstances where I can't actually detect a zombie. I don't... I think... I think the radar always works. From memory, but at the same time, you can see why Like I'm actually kind of spooked in this game. So we're just going to ready the bat in case. I'm not getting it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. OK, 
Okay, here we go. So this is a vent, huh? Ah, a little shortcut. What loot? The hell? Oh. Okay, so I have to hold X, and I have to drag it out into my inventory. So good thing that's barricaded then. Yeah, I don't think I ever found this room. This is really cool. So on the, on the gamepad right now, I am tapping like a madman. Okay. Yeah, I wish there was a crouch. Survival Horror has tra trained me to like crouches. So there are... Let's try to count. For your sake. One, two, three, four, five. There are a lot of fucking zombies. We will be going back this way. Through the other door. I don't know where they all are. There are... Holy shit. To give you an idea. There are, right in front of us, a whole fuck ton. I think they're below us. I am a coward. So... Okay. Empty. Beautiful, that actually makes this easier. I never ventured down here. So I don't know if zombies get faster. I don't know how any of that works. I know there's a spitting attack eventually. A la OG RE3. I mean, that's what the Paleheads have in the remake. I'm only bringing up Remake 3 as a point of comparison because I've just been replaying some of it. I'm actually thinking of doing a, um, a quick video on it again. You know, for a third time. On, um, Nightmare. Because I walked out into that first alleyway and went, Huh. There are some changes. I knew there were some changes. I just wasn't expecting expecting them to be that apparent that quickly. Rightio, so let's have a look. So this body is not coming up as anything worth attacking. I don't know if that's like a fake out mechanic. But as you can see, nothing to worry about. So yeah, the, um, the hell was that? Oh, that's so we can bug out. Yeah, so I know we have to go this way. So let's just do a quick. There are zombies right below us. Okay, they have bullets. Right, so the good thing is you only have to just drag them up. Yeah, so, so far on the channel, I've only done games like... Well, I oh newspaper, neat. I'm fairly familiar with, and I'm not a big coward playing. I you know um, suitcase. There is oh suitcase. Nothing in the suitcase. Right. Um, yeah, barring remake three, I'm quite familiar with all the games I've played on the channel so far. Um, excluding the whole you know fact. Well, with RE3, the fact that I, you know, played Remake 2. So I had a good idea as to how it worked. Now, she'll try to come over. So we just give her a jolly fucking smack. You cheeky bastard. Oh. She's not done. Come here, you slag. Over here. So the more you swing, the, uh, the weaker you get. Oh, fuck. So there is a finishing mechanic. And we got some drink. Beautiful. Yeah, so there is a finishing off mechanic. I totally forgot how to do it. So due to the nature of how my TV is, yeah, this is going to be a little awkward. Oh yeah, locked door, huh? Really? I remember that much too. What the fuck? Oh fuck. Oh shit! Ah, uh, come on. Shit, you've got incoming. Check your radar. <sighs> yep. Anything else? As you can see, they take quite a fucking beating. 
She is still alive. Oh my god, come on. Whoa. There are... How many zombies? There is one that can't get to me. It's nowhere near me. Whew. So, I felt rather pleased with that. There we go. Got it. That's the one. I feel like I did the smart thing. Remove barricade. Need a hammer, of course. I feel like I did the smart thing of not going into the room immediately and meeting her out here. That definitely worked. What the fuck? Ah, neat. So that'll... That'll fix the door. It also blocks the point of entry. Kinda. What have you got? Anything? Empty, of course. So, we know zombies can open doors. This was not a startling revelation. My torch is down to 40. And there's no zombies around, so I'm going to turn it off. And just like that, it is already at... 99. This safe house is my handiwork. Okay, so we're going to a direction I'm not familiar with. Ah, oh, fuck. I help them fortify places like this. Okay, there are there's some life signs right ahead. Now, the fake ad is rats, I believe, count for something. Yep, there we go. So they've all scampered off. But we're going to just keep this raised. Yeah, yeah, it was all rats. Beautiful. I'd be getting something otherwise. Alright. Oh, that's what it is. Bureto. Subarashi. I say as they play a French game about England being infested with zombies. Hey, it's you. It's the guy from Remake 2. They can't fall down in Remake 3. Ooh, a candy bar. Or energy bar, whatever. Not me muesli, so... It'll have to suffice, however. Use the ladder. Like, I'm not on edge playing this per se, but I am being very cautious. Oh, what's that? Haha, -ha, firing speed. Oh! Huh. Neat. Okay, so this is a door too, so I honestly think having these open is probably the best way to go. Because it gives me, um, you know, gives me time to gun it. A little easily, more easily. I always like these little loading screens. So there is a pseudo fast travel in this game through the sewers, from memory. Or at least this is kind of how it works. It, you just kind of, it, it's kind of what... I guess what Dark Souls 2 was actually trying to do, where it's meant to cover the space between areas, except for in a Souls game, you got to play that distance. Just, you know, if you didn't know already, Dark Souls 2 is a deeply flawed game. Am I, do I, am I going to miss something if I hit B? Or am I just stuck here until I hit B? Oh, there we go. Beautiful. So that's the way we came. predicted the plague, and the great fire of London that stopped it. And he saw plague victims in his own lifetime. Even tried to find a cure. The panacea. But it's a myth. You can see as well as anyone. There's no cure for this. So, cool thing is, on the mini-map, I don't have a map. Use your pad to scan that door, and I'll hack it open for you. Alright. Nope. There we go. So, we... So what I have to do is I aim at the red light and I hold hack. I've locked the place down for your safety. Okay, you're free to come and go now. Right. So yeah, because we don't actually have a map of the area, I can ping. I just can't see um you know the world around me right now. I have to explore for that. Now security cameras you can't hack, right? Huh, have I gone a different way or no no this is the way you meant to go. Yeah, this is right. Okay. Yeah, I wish I knew how light 
work with the zombies or how they reacted to it. Look, there's nothing in there. Yeah. Looking for movement? Nothing. Yeah, so I was looking it up. Um, unsurprising that this, you know, this kind of game took a lot of inspiration from several survival horrors. But apparently it took... Um, oh yeah, zombies down there. It took um, inspiration from the um, Peter Jackson King Kong game. Now, I have no context for that because I've never played it. I think one of my primary school mates owned it on PS2. Oh, there's a good chance he might still have it. So, the crow counted as an enemy there. We have a Z Zambimbi down there. Nothing in dumpster number one. Nothing in dumpster number two. There is going to be a lot of fucking nothing in this game. So that's... Is that a box there? No, that's just a light. So let's just do another quick scan. Nothing. Okay. You just walked past a working junction box, by the way. That's a camera hub, in case you've never noticed one before. The fuck? I'm blind. Help. <laughs> wonder if that's meant to be a 28 Days Later reference. Because I know that's it. So wait, where, where the fuck did I miss it? I feel really... Oh, bingo. Ah, sorry, I'm kind of fucking up my buttons here. Hack it. There we go. Hacked. I have a map now. Beautiful. Without a good map. You're a goner out there. That's, uh, that's solid advice. Except for souls, where it's like, no, get good, though. Now, I don't believe there's anyone else. So, let's see. Are there stealth attacks? I don't believe there are. You can just get the jump on them very easily. Come on, Sean of a dead time. So, here we go. Well... Yeah, you make a lot of noise in this game. So there's a door to hack here. I'll go explore those houses in a moment. I'm pretty sure we have to hack this, or... We can just open it. Yeah, there are no zombies. There's a manhole nearby that's your quickest way back to the safe house. Ah. Uganda. That's Sometimes what this is, of course. Is your best option. Analyze. Small map updated. So yeah, this is how the pseudo fast travel works. And you gotta tap the manhole too. Good work, soldier. I don't know if I like being addressed as a soldier. I don't have any overt problems with military. I have problems with how they might be used, however. Oh wow, you're not done, huh? Yeah? Oh, I'll be careful. So it's a hole. Yep. Well, that Mortal Kombat fin- What was that? What the hell was that? Yep, there is at least one Zambi outside. We'll head back and we'll do some exploring, I suppose. Can't use the fire extinguisher. Man, that sucks. So again, I don't know if they re repopulate. I don't know how any of this fucking works. Dumpster? Nothing. Dumpster? Nothing. It's easier at this point just to hit B when I start digging digging around. I think I know where I'm going to call it quits. And, well, could be sooner than I think. You won't be on first F. What the hell was that? Yeah, it's, it's the ones milling around out there. Ah, so this is a way to there. So there is a single... I know there's multiple, but there's just a single one there. Yeah, just on the edge of my radar. So let's see if we can get the jump on it. This is kind of a dumb way to approach this. I should have approached from there. So where are, we? Where are they? We're on the other side of the Ambo. Alright. Yeah, I don't know how noise works either. I don't know if we're adhering to Soulsian design philosophy. 
Apparently we can't walk through shrubbery, so that's already conflicting with my Dark Souls knowledge. The fuck are you? Huh? Hey, hold on, sorry. I'm looking at the map right now. That's one right ahead. I don't think we're dealing with this. Yeah, this game is very good at paranoia. I'll give it that much. Hell, I'll give it a lot of credit for the stuff it's done. The fuck is that? Where the fuck was that prompt? Pick up. Pick up what? Now they could come in handy. Bright lights to distract the dimwits. What the hell was that? Okay, it's the one all the way down there. Cool. I don't entirely trust the minimap though, as we have learned. Because that cop zombie I just beat the crap out of. Well, you know. He wasn't as down for the count as the game wanted me to think. Kinda dumb we can't move over those. I can fucking shovel washing machine if I have to. It's not like I've been to the gym in a long time, but I can do that. Definitely built enough to do that. Right, let's have a look. Nothing? Yeah, this is this is about this is England alright. Not in fucking England. I really love that line. Don't know why. And if what you wanted to rain, not in fucking England. So that's a camera. So that's the justification for how we can see... The fuck? Oh! Nothing. Can we exit the suitcase, please? Thank you. Domo arigato. So yeah, sorry, I've kind of just done this for no reason, apparently. So that's great. We're going to close this. We are learning our Soulsian shortcuts. We'll close this behind us. Now, we can go back any time we want and rest. Need a lockpick. If only I had a jilt sandwich. Did he despawn? Oh, so he did. Oh. Oh, oh, mighty cinder block. Troller of that gate in Ravenholm. I'll have to fucking show that off one day. I think I've mentioned it before, but I worked at some cool fucking tech in Half-Life 2. But no one Use seems to have recorded. Radar. You have to ping areas manually if you want to know what's lurking in your blind spots. There are a lot. Now, I believe this is where we get introduced to, like, a, what, not a screamer, but something that will shout and yell. So, let's see. So, as you can see, crow. Several crows missing. <laughs> nice. That inadvertently reminds me of Dark Souls 1. Like a lot of games. That street corner reminds me of Left 4 Dead, actually. Yeah, so they're just kind of milling around. we got to jump down and deal with them. So there's something over there. So that corpse is probably alive. Should leave a corpse well alone, I believe, is the uh, message we took from Bloodborne. How the fuck do you reload? Why? Got it. 13 bullets? Rad. Not enough to kill anything that moves, but that's a considerable amount. I've got 9 in reserve. I have a fuck ton of flares. I should have been paying attention to the flares, to be honest. Okay, you know what? Sorry, one sec. Backpack time. Let's equip, equip a flare. Let's just have a look. Ah, uh, you can only equip one at a time. Neat. That's in the My Resources tab. Oi, you jolly wankers. Get a load of this. Ow, fuck. They definitely sound like 28 Days Later zombies, don't they? Yep. You like that priest at the start, actually. That's what you're reminding me of. Haha, iframes. No, not iframes. Oh, fuck. What? What a waste of life. <laughs> God damn. Well, at least I get to show off, you know, the core mechanic of this. So, I was going to kind of bring this up anyway. Um, due to a lack of internet, you're actually missing out on a lot of the cool shit. 
So yeah, so this is the little intro sequence. So the prep has found a new person. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, I remember her. I think the characters are pretty much always the same. Now you always start with this pretty, the pretty bad. Look lively. The cameras up by the supermarket still need fixing. Okay, Time to bingo. Your keep. So this is our way back. Yeah, and you can choose. Back to Brick Lane Markets. Yeah, no, I, I fucked that up big time. So, yeah, before the internet... Well, before Meverse was shut down, there used to be an invasion system. Well, I'm being sarcastic, but... Actually, it's eerily weird how close it was to Dark Souls, in a way. So, I've died. My guy is a zombie. I've got to kill him to get my stuff back. So, supposedly, what could happen in the game was... If you so we got to scan that box again okay that's neat so I don't have the map for this area anymore yeah okay this is how they do it got it can we troll the game oh wait no 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 no, no. sorry wrong door we have the map that's out here that's um that's back here this is the way we need to go can we fall down the manhole haha <laughs> beautiful Excellent. So yeah, I died. I've got to go kill myself. Hopefully I don't kill myself killing myself. That would be inopportune and not great. So there are several zombies again. Some are probably the fucking birds. So here's the fun part. I have a gun with six shots in it apparently. There's dickhead who killed me. He is quite sprightly. Can you climb? Where the fuck? Oh, we can! Oh, we did it! No, nope, no, nope, no, nope, there we have. Yep. Yep, so that's the system. That's what I get for being fucking inept. So, yeah, we've got all our resources back. Technically, a little more, too. Yep, whoops. So, yeah, you can um, click on your items while doing that for a little description. So, birds, fuckers, dickhead who killed me. I don't know if I retain damage. Because that lady we were beating up has gone. Which I'm quite content with. Oh, wait, I didn't... Oh, I didn't actually drag him into my bag. Well, that could have been really bad. That looked fucking weird and kind of creepy. Can a corpse... Can a corpseless... A headless corpse attack me? Bloody hope not. Okay. Bet you're fucking alive. Alright. So, the stuff ahead. They're just the birds. Where is that corpse, though? Here, see me. Yeah, mate. Oh, you're a different guy. Different character model. I didn't know they did that. That's cool. So, I don't know if they're randomized or they just intentionally do that. Yeah, so it takes a lot to kill a zombie, in case you hadn't noticed. Okay, let's just check something. I'm getting nothing. Which means there are no zombies around here. But just to make sure... I wonder how good they are at playing dead. Empty. Yeah, so if you don't see empty, you'll notice I'm automatically going into the loot mode. Nothing. Fire escape. But only we could try to push this dumpster. It's on wheels, I could fucking do that. I'm sure, sure Amy can do it if Tom could do it. A bit weird we can't go in here though. So yeah, this is a shove a la left for dead, but you have to prepare your strike like I've been doing this whole time. I just don't know how useful the shove is. What the hell was that? It happened again. What the fuck? Hold on a bloody minute, what the hell? Why am I getting... 
Why am I getting blips on my radar for here? I'm not now. The fuck was that? Oh yeah, we can loot this dumpster. Ooh. Neat. So we have five empty slots in the backpack. Fucking rad. Yeah, apologies if this video isn't actually too interesting. And if it isn't, it's actually because I'm very on edge. So I am getting a beep. Yeah, it's at the very edge of my radar. It's right ahead. Oh boy, here we go. Point and overturn. Again, left for dead style. Oh, it's the fucking crow. Piece of shit. Yeah, I don't know how reliable the radar is. I want to... I want to assume it'll always tell me the truth. But who fucking knows. Alright, so... End of the video is actually very much in sight. Fuck. It was rigged to the alarm. Get inside before every blighter from miles around comes running. Whoa, fuck. Hey, Nick Frost. In Hot Fuzz. What was actually a really funny film that I liked quite a bit. Ah, oh, fuck. You blood, you dicks can move. Whoa, okay. Oh, this is some nice lighting. Huh. So there's some more ar Oh! Let's just do a quick check. Yeah, there are some in the shop. What a surprise. Okay, neat. Anything else? Bullets. Now, I don't know how much of a last resort shooting a gun is. But I'd rather not, unless I really have to. Door here. No, it's not. Okay. Well, as I said, end of video is in sight. So let's try some shooting mechanics. Fuck. The lighting is really aggressive in this. The hell are they? The beating on that door, apparently. Yeah, well, we're not removing that, I suppose. Barricades. Shit. Find a hammer. Find a hammer. You're gonna need to rip the planks off some doors. Yes, we are. Oh, hammer. Bingo. Please tell me I have room. I apparently don't have room. Fuck me, I'm all out of enemies. Yes, I do. Not nailed down, loot it. What the hell was that? Wait, did I actually get the hammer or not? Fuck. No, okay, I didn't. God damn it. This is actually quite stress inducing to be completely honest. Wait, where the fuck is it? Okay, no, I no no, okay. It's just it's an item I just have on me. Yep. Oh, nothing's even happening right now. I'm actually realistically fairly safe. Yeah, so I don't know if I'll ever do this as like a full vid one day. If it would, it would be around a particular spooky month. It would perhaps be some kind of storm of shit of some description, I suppose. Okay, this is a bad idea, I'm sure. Good thing I'm good at tapping. What the fuck? Uh, what? Let's try that scan again. Okay. <laughs> nice. If you couldn't tell, it was rats. It was Earth all along. On the off chance. I don't want to have the radar lie to me. Man, I'm having to do like the weirdest claw motion to get all value out of this game. Out of the gamepad. Oh, there we go. Alright, shall we learn? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. 
I think that's the first time I've ever shot a gun in this game. Nah, it's probably a lie, actually. I shot it once before, I'm sure. That sounds like something breaking. Does not fill me with confidence. So, we have confirmed it's right for me to be incredibly fucking paranoid. Because corpse is getting back up. Do not trigger on the minimap. Ah, oh, yeah, there we go. Fuck. I'm impressed I missed. What a way to die, huh? On you, mate. You've done well. Yep, cool. Was that a ping? Oh, no. Oof. I don't know if this video is mostly me just going, oh, but that's kind of how it feels. These buggers are a lot faster than I expected. Link the pad up to bring the cameras back online. Okay, there's something ahead. Okay. Nope, not anymore. Makes me think we're relatively safe. That's the box. Which is better safe than sorry. No one gets in. We got a heart was all we have a heart. We got a defenseless old man out here. Man, I, uh, I fucking hope Back for Blood's good. It'd be nice. The idea that some people actually just want Left 4 Dead with prettier graphics is kind of dumb, though. Let it have it. Let it have its own identity. Okay, there we go. Hacked. Hacking the mainframe. Good. The CCTV cameras are back online. Every time you scan one of those junction boxes, I'll hack it and update your smart map. Take a look at your pad. Hey there, fuck it. Ooh! What the hell? Mate, what is... What is going on? <laughs> Fucking hell, he's he's got some moves. Good. Now find your way back to that shortcut you passed earlier and get your ass back to the safe house in one piece. Okay. Now this is the part where zombies start breaking in, I believe. End of video in sight. Thank Christ, I don't know if my heart can take any more of this. Okay, phew. We're on the outside. Ah, oh, there you are, you shit lord. Get out of there. Out my way, comrade. There we go. Oh fuck. Yep. Yes, I am sure. <laughs> that was genuine panic for that second. I'm not even fucking kidding. I really should have closed the doors. Oh. Yeah, so that's Zombie you. Like, again, I don't know how it looked. Um, if, like, this video sold my actual, genuine, like, unease. So you made it back. But fuck. Now, you may have noticed a box in the main room with a raven symbol on it. Time to show you how it works. All right. Teach me, Prepper Chan. Shite. And not before time. There's a horde approaching. Check your radar. Um, it's not working. Fuck. Alright. Well, if I die here, the perfect way to close out the vid. We're gonna leave you. And so, you know what? No, I want this open. Wait, where? Okay, I see him. Yep. Ah, gob shite. Yeah, so basically, if they get a bite on you, you're fucked. 
Now the problem is, because I'm dealing with these two, I can't really look at the radar. Now there is one coming through the room on the right. They have climbed over, so now I'm going to be dealing with three zombies and I only have a single bullet in my gun. Whoa. Alright. Fuck me. Okay, so that's all of them. There's none ahead. There's none around me. We're going to use our soul's knowledge to cut these fucks. Ho ho! Get fucked. Okay, so one's coming around the side, so i got to be very mindful of that. That did that. We're going to cross over. Yep. Whoa! Excellent. Nope, I apparently using the gamepad. Well done, me. Well, this is actually really fucking tense. Alright, so we got a couple of them. We got these chuckle fucks. Some are trying to cut me off. Ah, oh, fuck. Well, that's it. I was too slow. Yeah, so zombie you. I'm not very good at this. I hope it was entertaining, though. So that was M Emily, not Amy. The fuck was I saying? So Thomas, Emily, and who's the unlucky third person who's not going to be played? Are you prepared? No. Wake up! There's a bloody grey horde on its way to your front door! Batten down the hatches! Get up! I've spotted a horde of blighters heading your way. You've only got a few moments to prepare. Now move! 